very shallow vesicle. Okay, I'm back. Um, this is, um, I'm going to show you my washi tape, um, how I organize my washi tape. Um, this is for Marissa, who's MAM1016. Hi, Marissa. I hope you're doing good. Um, she had asked me um, how I store my washi tape. So since I'm um, in my room and um, packing my stuff away, I just wanted to share with you um, how I pack it up, how I pack it before I um, put it away in the box. But um, I got this. This is actually a ribbon holder from, um, let's see, from Walmart. And everybody has their own version of what works for them as far as organization. So this works for me. I, um, like I said in my last video, I like displaying the things that I have and I like to take care of them. Um, and I like to know that they're there. So I like them to be out and not put away and hidden where I can't see them, especially my washi tape because I do use them. So um, again, I got this um, spinning ribbon thing from Walmart and I believe this was like $10 for this and then this is a ribbon holder from um, Tuesday morning and this was like super cheap um, it was like less than $10 or something so it's all disorganized right now but um, I want to get another one of these eventually after we move so um, basically this is how I store my washi tapes um, I know a lot of people, I've seen other people store them in like bins because they have a lot more than I do. So I only have this much. So I just wanted to share that with you. So um, I hope this helps and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.